Hey, welcome to Dreams in Action. I want to give a high five, a fist bump, a shout out to all the listeners tuned into this motivational channel. Hey, listen, I am up here on the North Shore of Hawaii, just uh, having some dinner on the beach. In fact, let me pause for a second just to show you some of the views. It's incredibly beautiful. Take a look at where I am. Incredibly beautiful, a remarkable land of peace. Literally right here, many, many restaurants, hotels on the beach. I'm specifically up here on the North Shore right now having dinner, having some crab cake and uh, swordfish at the Beach House. It's the Beach House Restaurant. Let me just show you the name up here. This is the Beach House Restaurant. Uh, 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 gracias, senor. Um, this is an incredible restaurant here. It's this is Saturday, so it's kind of um, still kind of early in the later day. It would usually get filled up a little later too. So you have individuals finishing the beach and coming out here to have some dinner. So I, I, I wanted to jump on really quick. I wanted to share something. All right, I wanted to share something. Right now, you can see the page flooded, right, with a lot of brothers choosing to the, the conversation about passport brothers. And I want to join in on the conversation. I want, first of all, I want to give a high five, a fist bump. Let me sit down, a high five, a fist bump. A shout out to all those brothers who are rocking, getting their passports and going where you are celebrated, juxtaposed to being tolerated. Let me say that again. Wanting to go where you are celebrated, compared to where you are tolerated. Listen, I want you to do that. In fact, I want more brothers to get their passports and travel the world and just see the world for what it is, a remarkable, beautiful place. I was reading a, a sacred text the other day. It was the story about Abraham. He was, at the time, he was wanting a wife for his son and he was telling someone who had worked for him or worked with him he said, listen, I need you to do something. I want you to go now to a land. I want you to go get your passport and I want you to take your passport and I want you to go to this land and you're going to look for a wife for my son. And after you do this and at the end of the obligation, if she chooses to come, great. If she chooses not to come, you are out of this oath. But I want you to promise me that you will get your passport and go to this place and look for a wife for my son. But here it is, This is these are the guidelines. When you go there, you're going to sit outside the city, you're gonna come inside the city after observing and then come into the city and watch the people who come out. You're going to observe her. You're gonna see how she interacts with the men that's there. You're gonna see how they interact with her. You're gonna see how she interact with other women. You're gonna see how she carries herself. And after you have done that, you have observed that then you're going to ask her to serve you. You're going to ask her after she has been serving, getting water and all those things, after she's tired. You're going to ask her to give you a drink. And not only is she going to give you a drink, but I want you to watch and see if she say, not only shall I give you a drink, shall I also give all of your camels a drink of water as well. Now mind you, this man has traveled for miles with camels. The camels for his purpose to pass on to the family as a dowry. So not only does she have to go get the bucket of water to lower it at the water and carry it to him to, to give him a drink, but she also must give the camels a drink also. Did you catch that? Did you catch that? And so after that she does that, then you get put the wrist on her 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 arm or her feet or her ankles and then you go to the family and you explain the family what took place that she has been chosen to come to be the wife of the bride of Abraham's son now if the family releases her great if the family does not release her then you are free from this oath now what if you were to break this down what if you were to father fellas brothers brothers <laughs> what if you were to break this down what if you were to say listen I want you to go to the land that you have your passport and to go to find someone for your life or your sons to set your life up. So you gotta get your passport. And she must be fit, feminine, friendly, submissive, cooperative, 
uh, that's I, I definitely uh, I learned that from uh, you know brother Kevin Samuels. I'm definitely breaking this down. So shout out to those who are continuing using the content or just making it their own. So even the password book about being cooperative or culturally fit or exercise and take care of themselves, eat right, eat healthy, all of that. Now, classifications. You go to this place, not only is she going to serve you, but she's going to serve your purpose. Did you catch that? And so I'm just wondering, I'm curious, as we say in the land of therapy of clinicians, I'm, I'm, I'm curious, I'm wondering, perhaps, as we continue to, the brothers continue to explore other countries that they observe other communities are they really beginning to see that there are those who are willing to serve you and to serve your purpose as you serve one another hey just a thought just a thought hey go ahead and like subscribe share come on help me walk with me ride with me roll with me all right talk with you soon talk with you soon hey thank you for joining me Hey, my, my crab cakes are ready. My red wine is sitting there on the table. And I'm just going to uh, take my time. I'm in no rush. I'm sitting here on the beach in Hawaii enjoying myself. I want to welcome you. I want to invite you to Hawaii. This is an incredible, beautiful place of peace. It is truly paradise. Paradise. Let's see how much time I have left here. And afterwards, we'll see what's next. Hey, I want to high five, fist bump, and shout out to all the listeners. Thank you for joining the page. Talk with you soon. Bye.